One of the sneakiest things in life is that you don't really pay for things with money. You pay with time. Money's just the middleman. Every purchase has two prices, a dollar price and a time price. Once you see it that way, your decisions change. Let's apply that to energy. The average electric bill in the U.S. is about 165 bucks a month. If your time is worth, say, $25 an hour, that means you're trading six and a half hours of your life every month just to power the house. A whole workday gone every single month when you figure in deductions. Push that over 20 years, which is the life of a solar system, and that bill becomes $40,000. In time, that's 1,580 some hours. Almost a full year of your life spent working for electricity. Now let's flip the equation with solar. When you build solar, you start buying that time back. Every watt you make is one you don't owe the power company. You keep the time instead of trading it away. Most people stop at offsetting their bill. Maybe they get lucky and their utility offers one-to-one -one net metering. But best case, you're still just breaking even. You're swapping power you made for power you could buy. It's still a straight trade. Mining changes the equation again. Day only mining takes the same sunlight, but pushes it into a different bucket. Now that watt of solar is generating value. You're storing power in Bitcoin, which is an appreciating asset. That means your sunlight can buy more of your future, not just erase a bill. In my system, the power company is my backup. My house runs off solar, my shop runs off solar, my miners run off solar. Instead of trading my time for power, the sun works for me and builds something I can hold into the future. People say solar pays for itself, but if you use it right, solar pays you. First by giving you back the hours you were losing to the utility, and then by turning free power into something that could grow in value for the next decade. So the next time you look at the cost of energy, don't ask how much per kilowatt hour. Ask how much of your life it takes to pay for it and whether you want to keep trading your hours away or start letting the sun earn your future instead. Hope you got something out of this. If so, hit that like and subscribe if you're not. Until next time, adios.